Carlita, good morning. Morning, teacher. Hello, Carlita. <laughs> Always on time. <laughs> That's no, nice, no, Carlita. But <laughs> mm, yeah, I can say what well, sometimes XI is first. <laughs> he sleeps with his computer. <laughs> How was your day yesterday? Mm. Fresh. Very good. Very good. Yeah, it was nice. It was raining yesterday. Um, Do you remember in the afternoon? Yes, I it remember. Mm -hmm. It was raining a lot. That's nice. I like I like rainy days. Mm. Yes, but no, all the all the night. Mm. Oh, well, it's dangerous, right? Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's dangerous. But yesterday, um, it was raining here where I live in the afternoon at three p.m. more or less. It started. And about five, five, five thirty, you know, it was over. It, at yeah. night, uh -huh, at night, it rained a little bit more, but no all the night. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. I think I it's when it's raining, but not all the night because it, it's dangerous. And another is because uh, I hate the <laughs> folks. Floats. 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 Las inundaciones. Uh, no. No. Tapos. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the frogs and toads. Uh -huh. um, oh my God, I understand now. Oh, yes, okay. and I hate to, I hate to see any little animal jumping in yeah. there in your, in your garden. <laughs> yes. So. You know, when I, I, I had a very bad experience a long time ago, um, some friends and I decided to rent a ranch in the, in the beach. Mm. So we, we were very excited. I asked permission from, uh, from my mom and my dad, and they said, yeah, you can go. Anyways, you are working and you are independent. Go, 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 go. And I was like, okay. So we were supposed to stay there for three days. The first day, Carlita, the first day we arrived, we put our things, you know, and organize our things. In the afternoon, we had to go to the beach. And then we had already like uh, bought things for, for dinner. Mm -hmm. And in the, in the ranch, there was a swimming pool. So mm -hmm. we were expecting a beautiful, uh, you know, three days vacation. Mm -hmm. and, <laughs> About 6.30 or 7 p.m. it started to rain. Mm -hmm. And we said, well, it's, maybe it's normal. It never stopped. All the night, it was raining and raining and raining and raining. About 4 a.m., more or less, my friend, we were, we were um, sleeping in the same, in the same, uh, bedroom. We were three girls in the same bedroom. We had one um, one double bed, and we had an extra little bed. And mm -hmm. my friend who was sleeping in the extra little bed it, it screamed, ah! and we woke up. And some other friends that were in the other bedroom arrived to our bedroom, you know, for our surprise, Carlita. Our mm -hmm. bedroom was full of uh, little frogs. Oh. The sound when we opened the door was like oh. it was horrible, Carlita. The swimming pool was full. When I tell you that maybe there were 100 frogs in the pool, it was a little <laughs> amount. Oh. Everybody jumped you know and we were like no we gotta do something the plants and some kind of uh, vegetation around the swimming pool was full of uh, like i don't know like kind of white uh, liquid that some some other people arrived from the, 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 the people that usually take care of the ranches they came and they said ah no we have here a 
because it, it is, is it was raining and it is going to continue raining he said all the mm -hmm. frog have come here so mm -hmm. i better i well i recommend you to leave the place because they are not going to leave and we were like gosh in, at 6 a.m carlita we were back to san salvador we were coming back in our cars very sad disappointed they gave us uh, the money back from the ranch but it was the worst experience in my life oh uh, no so can you imagine Carlita? Uh, hopefully i don't have phobia yes i don't have a phobia for these animals but can man, can you imagine if you go there and you don't like a simple frog it was something yeah. i would never forget <laughs> <laughs> That's why when people say, hey, let's go to, to the beach and let's live there. Uh, okay, let's go in summer. <laughs> because now mm -hmm. August is, well, you know, in El Salvador, August is still raining. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was there. I was there. <laughs> I, I could imagine. You know? Can you imagine waking up in the frog going under the, the, the door? <gasps> because there were too much. I mean, like, the, the sound was too much. The sound that the frogs make, I don't know, they, I don't know, I felt yeah. like that. And too many, too many frogs jumping and on the, in the, in the swimming pool. Ah. So, Gosh. yes. <laughs> yeah, it's so nasty. Uh -huh. And I had never, I have never seen, you know, a, such a, I don't know, picture when I went out and I saw a lot of frogs around. But anyways, yes. mm -hmm. it happened to me. <laughs> so believe me, it was so, so I didn't know you were scared of, of, of these animals, Carlita. Yes, I have, uh, I, maybe it's, it's a phobia. <laughs> a phobia, yeah, I see so. <laughs> okay, uh, hey, Juan Carlos is here. Hi, good morning, Juan Carlos. Okay, Exa, good morning, hello. Good morning. My pleasure to see you. Hello, Juan Carlos. How was your day yesterday? Good morning, good morning. Morning, morning. How was your day yesterday? Uh, uh, At home. It was, it was uh, good. It was good? Okay, nice. Yeah. You know, guys, I don't know if it is me, but the time goes quickly. Now is the 11th, almost the first, uh, the first 15 days of August. Incredible. My yes, goodness. Teacher. I don't know. Something is going to happen. <laughs> it's too, too fast. Too fast. Okay. Hey, Vero is here too. Hi, Veronica. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. How are you, Veronica? Okay. How are things in your house? Everything good? Good. Happy. Very, good. Very nice. Okay. I'm happy to see that. Okay. And what about Exa? You have problems in your connection, Exa? Your microphone? My audio. Oh, there you are. Uh huh. Okay. Now I can hear you. That's good. Okay. Very good, Exa. That's nice. Okay. Very, very nice. Okay, guys. Well, okay. I'm very happy to see everybody. Okay. Once again, you know, as I was telling Carlita in, in Juan Carlos, the time is flying. Okay. Uh, now we have the second session, okay, but almost, okay, finishing um, the section number two, okay, now we continue with this video conference, but today we have a different topic, okay, today we have a, a very, very different topic, okay, it's a topic related to the suggestions, okay, okay, and everything, let me check here, okay. And remember today we have also, guys, uh, we have also um, the, the, the presentations. Okay, I'm sorry, I cannot open this file. I don't know what's going on. Let me check. Okay, with something's happening here. We also have, guys, uh, as I was saying to you yesterday, uh, some presentations. Okay, Juan Carlos, uh, let me see who else is missing for today. Juan Carlos Araceli and Dalila, I think. Uh -huh, and Itzel. Okay, you are going to do the presentation uh, later on. Okay, this is what we're going to do. Guys, today we're going to study about um, using wood better. Okay, I remember last time you had a little problem with this exercise 
because uh, we haven't studied this yet, but now we are going to, we're going to study this, okay, for today, don't worry. And um, let me open this file because I have problems with this one. Uh, I'm going to try to open this file for you. Okay, there we go. Okay, guys, okay, that, this is what we're gonna do. Hey, Elena, good morning, hello, hello. Hi, good morning. Uh, how are you, Lee? Hi. Are you okay? Yes. <laughs> Everything much better in your home? Eh, so, so. So, so, okay, but we keep on praying, oh? Okay, this is important. Okay, that's it, guys. Well, my friends, this is a survey that I have for you, okay, for, for, for this day, okay? This is a, a survey about food. I'm so sorry to continue talking about food. I know you could be hungry by this time. Uh, but anyway, this is the topic that we have here, okay? So uh, there are some questions here, okay? I have here 14 questions, right? Uh, easy questions, okay? But th these are questions related to, to your personal opinions about food, okay? Uh, let me start with Exa. Can you please the first five questions, Exa? If you could see this, uh, let me let me have it a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. That's What's it. your favorite food? Mm -hmm. Next yeah, one, usually, number two. Mm -hmm. You usually eat breakfast? What do you usually have for breakfast? What time do you usually have dinner? Do you like cooking? Okay, very mm. good. Do you like cooking? That's it. Very good. Let's continue with number six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we're going to uh, ask Lili Liliana. Okay, Lili, number six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Six. Do you often snack between meals? Okay. Uh, what do you, What do you like to have for snacks? Do you like desserts? What kind of desserts do you like? Do you like American food? Mm -hmm. Ten. Do you like spicy food? Spicy food, okay. Well, talking about the number nine, I understand that some people have this problem to say that American is all America. You know, Mexico, Peru, Chile, El Salvador, everything included. But in this case, um, I'm referring to food for the United States, you know, stuff like hot dogs, okay, hamburgers, you know, this kind of food they have, okay. And do you like spicy food? Okay, well, people who love Mexican food, like, uh, like Exa, right, they maybe they like spicy food, okay, well, they, they might like it. And the number 11, okay, let's continue. 11, 12, 13, and 14. And hey, my friend, um, Juan Carlos, can you please help me read? Do you eat quickly or slowly? Mm -hmm. Do you like eat out at restaurant? Do you think you have a healthy diet? Do you like? Okay, very good. Uh -huh. Excellent. Uh -huh. The number 14, guys, is optional. Here you have to make up a question, okay, because you have to uh, ask the question to your partners, right? That's it. Those are something related to, to, to food, okay? And this is your personal, okay, personal, personal opinion we have there, okay? Uh, maybe you cannot copy the, 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 the answers in the worksheet but I want you to use your notebook, okay? Because I want you to write the answer that the person is going to give you, okay? For example, if I ask Ileana, Ileana, do you like cooking? Mm, not much. <laughs> not much, okay. So this is, this is the question's answer, right? But you have to go a little bit beyond, okay? So you say why you like it or whether you not like it. I don't like. Uh huh. Don't you don't, well, you don't like it. Oh, you don't like it that much. Uh -huh. uh huh. So now you have to give me the reason why you don't like it that much. Ah, uh, I don't like cooking because uh, it's too hard and I. Uh huh. I don't know. <laughs> it's very difficult for you to cook. It's difficult. <laughs> okay. 
Eh, eh, how often do you cook? Um, three meals. The three uh -huh. meals I cook them because I need it, but uh -huh. I don't like it. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So uh, you have to do you do it, but you don't like it. Uh, it's so you, so you feel like uh, you feel like um, pressed and pushed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Well, uh, if you have the conversation with Nexa, well, Nexa is you know, oof, he loves cooking. Well, I don't know if you love it, but you do it, Nexa. Yes, I, mm -hmm. I do it. You do it there. Ah, okay, that's nice. And 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 every day, right, Exa? Uh, yes. Uh, the, well, it depends because some day I just uh, use their the sobras, <laughs> <laughs> the leftovers. <laughs> uh huh. All the leftovers. Right, the, 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 is the, como usan el pasado de leave, left, the leftovers, left over, las sobras, oh, right? Uh -huh, okay. Uh -huh, that's it. Oh my God, and you reheat the food. <laughs> yes, yes, okay. but uh, when, when I want some special, I cook every day. Ah, you cook every day. Okay, very good, that's it. So my friends, this is what you have to do. I am trying to share this with you, but I have problems. Me aparece ahí un error. I don't know, a mistake there. So can you please do me a favor? I'm going to display these questions and take a picture. Okay, take a picture, guys. Okay, take a picture of the one, two, three, four, five, six, and then I'm going to show you the rest of the questions, please. I, I don't know what happened, but it was a mistake. At the moment, I was going to send the, the file. And I try three times, okay? Take a picture, please. One, two, three, four, five, six. And now I'm going to display the next questions, right? Seven, eight, eight. let me see over here. Um, the next questions, okay. Seven, eight, nine, ten, okay. Eleven, twelve, and thirteen, okay, this case. What do you like to have for snacks? Do you like desserts? Do you like American food? Okay, and the number 13, do you think you have number 13 and the last one, a healthy diet? And the number 14, remember this is optional. Okay, this is optional. Okay, you have the pictures? The captures? Yes, Exa, Elena, do you have it? Carlita? Yes. Okay, very good. There we have 14. Okay, that's it. So now what you are gonna do different sure. guys? Yes, Carlita. Uh, I don't have the the uh, from one to six. From one to six. Okay, let's let me sorry do once again. Okay, don't worry. Okay, my friend, there you go. Okay, take a screenshot, please. Okay, what's your favorite food? Do you usually eat breakfast? What do you usually have for breakfast? Okay, what time do you usually have dinner? Okay, do you like cooking? And here, obviously, you have to tell me why. Okay, what's the reason? It's okay, like, teacher. Okay, it's very good. Like Illy said, right? Well, he is not a, a lover. <laughs> okay, a lover for, for baking food, but she has to. Okay. Yeah, it's, I, I like cooking, to be honest. Mm -hmm. I was telling my mother last weekend, hi, mama, if I hadn't been an English teacher, I would be a chef. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> okay. Hey, but some, hey, no, but it's, some, some months ago, I didn't think this, you know, I found my abilities. <laughs> You know, in this quarantine, yeah, I had to be cooking every day, so I discovered that in my, okay. So, my friends, those are the questions you have. You are going to start working right now, okay? But now it's something different. It's not just speaking. Try to understand, analyze information. Hey, beautiful Kathy Lee. Okay. <laughs> What's his name? Hey, her name yeah. is, is she, her name is Michi. Michi, ah, fullness. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so nice. Then you introduce Michi to me. Uh -huh, okay. 
Good. So guys, in pairs, pay attention to your partner's answers and please take notes in your notebooks, okay? Because then you're gonna give me, okay, your partner's answers, okay? And we're gonna analyze who deserves the extra points for this. Okay, my friends, accept the invitations right now. You are gonna be working in pairs, let me see. Okay, everybody's gonna work in pairs. If you don't have the questions yet, let me know and I will, I will uh, share the screen once again. I share the question in the WhatsApp group. Ah, okay, good, thank you. <laughs> hello, hello. Hi, <laughs> Don't worry, Carlita. I always I, do that. I always do that, but at the beginning of the class, right now. <laughs> no teachers, ma'am. I. They have tangles. Um, no. Tiene, uh, you know, tango. What a tango is? Not tanga, but a tango. <laughs> <laughs> No, I no? I don't remember what is the, the, the correct word, but nudo, I nudo, un, un, uh, un, uh, I I paint it. Oh, you dye your hair. You dye. Ah, okay. Uh, yes. Let me check tomorrow. I will check the video for from yesterday. But I I I told to to Ili that the the color. It's perfect, so, <laughs> oh, so I, I can it. do it. <laughs> you did it. You yes. did it in your house. Wow, that looks yes. nice, huh? Very nice. It looks very nice. Okay. I think that I, I love the... The, the color the, and the results. Yeah, the results. This yeah. is the most important thing, that you feel very nice, you feel relaxed, okay? At the moment you see yourself in the mirror, right? That's <laughs> that's cool. That's important. And that's it. In in English, you use die. 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 Okay. You die. Coloreo. You dye your hair. Okay. That, that that's color brown. I think it's kind of. Um. Yes, but it's like um, uh, blondie. But blondie. okay, okay, okay. It looks good. It looks good. But yeah, of it, course. It's okay. <laughs> Very nice. That's great. Okay, my friends, let's start with the question one. Okay. Um, let's ask uh, Carlita, you start asking Ili and then Ili you 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 you, you give the Okay, mm -hmm. my friend. What's your favorite food? Uh, my favorite food is pupusa. Because they eat in, in all meal. And uh, well, it's true. Pupusas can be eaten in for breakfast, for lunch, for dinner, for dinner, for the snacks, <laughs> for the snacks, and they eat it with eat. coffee. <laughs> yeah, with coffee. And what's your favorite kind? Uh, I like uh, rice pupusa. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. Say. That's okay, okay, rice. Rice, and, but I like chicken, chicken, cheese, uh, cheese. Yeah. cheese, cheese with a lot of <laughs> Oh, I love them. Mm -hmm. I, yeah. I don't like cheese. These pupusas, no, but they, with Morocco, yes, it's something special. Mm -hmm. Excellent, very good. Let, yeah. let me check the other guys, okay? Then I will, I will come back. Okay, okay very teacher, good. Bye. bye bye. Continue, please. Bye. Yes, I have usually don't have more time. I usually take breakfast at 10 minutes. Zero, 10 minutes breakfast? Yes, very, very, very fast. fast. 
Oh my God. And this is only now that you are at home or every day when you were in the office of uh, Vero? Uh, no, teacher. Um, the, to Monday uh, to Friday. Ah, from Monday to Friday when you're working. Yes. Mm. And what about you, Juan Carlos? Uh, I, I eat breakfast uh, before, before, uh, before class. Mm -hmm. uh, from, Monday, from Monday to Friday. In, in Saturday or Sunday, I eat breakfast around 7, 7 or 8. Oh, really? Okay. Seven from seven to eight a.m. Okay. Yeah. But not 10 minutes. Uh, no, no. Uh -huh. uh, okay. Maybe 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Okay. Good. Very good. Okay. Nice. Continue, please. Very good. Juan Carlos, um, what time do you. you... Mm -hmm. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Morning. Uh -huh. Practicing. What time do you usually have dinner? Maybe. Mm -hmm. Senior, what time do you have dinner? Um, maybe 6 p.m. And Very or nice. senior. <laughs> yes. 6 p.m. Ah, okay. Yes, I understand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay. Well, my daughter, what, how old is your baby? Three, two, um, two years, right? No, one. one. Oh, yes, of course. Also, she's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my, 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 my daughter is four years old and she eats about 7 p.m. now. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. And you, Exa, what time do you eat dinner? It depends. <laughs> depends? It, it depends. It uh, depends. Uh, for the world because if I have to stay connect, I eat seven, eight, and okay. sometimes at night, but just a cookie. Oh, okay, just like a snack. Uh -huh. Yes, because oh. if it's, it's too late, I don't eat. Yeah, it's true. Sometimes we can we can sleep well. Mm -hmm. Well, in my case, it happens. I can't mm. sleep well if I oh, eat more than night. Oh, my case. Ah, my you don't case. like cooking. <laughs> uh, no, uh, because I, I try to don't eat uh, a lot of food in the night. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Ah, for the good health. Uh -huh. That's good. Yes. Yeah, but that's nice, okay. And Dali, what time do you eat dinner? Mm. Los tres tiempos. <laughs> no, what time? What time? Siempre cocino. Mm -hmm. What time? ¿A qué horas? What time do you eat dinner? Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock at night or oh, late. Mm -hmm. One p.m. At what p.m.? Your lunch and breakfast? Seven or eight o'clock p.m. Ah, okay. In the, in the for breakfast in the class. Huh? <laughs> okay. No. No. no right. After the class, you know, dije las ocho de la mañana. Ah, eight o'clock. Okay, that's okay. Uh, there is a question there. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Exa, you can check the questions there. Uh, how much time do you take eating your your breakfast or something like that? How long? Do we have a question like that? Uh, do you usually eat breakfast? What time do you usually eat dinner? Ah, no, no, there is not. But let me ask, this is extra. How much time do you take eating your, 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 your breakfast? Well, in my case, because uh, I change my breakfast to yogurt and cookies, so I don't cons <laughs> <laughs> Yes, it's Ten my minutes, breakfast. Ten minutes, my friend. No, one minute because I just take the, the yogurt and the cookies. And did you have the big ones or the little ones? The uh, little ones. Ah, the little ones. And then you're not hungry anymore, Exa? Uh, yes, but I I drink a coffee at mm -hmm. 10, 
Tengo ahí ah, en... Okay. Like a snack. No, tengo more. Tengo en no more. more. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Well, yeah, I, 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 I eat because I have the time, maybe. Ok, I eat my breakfast and I take it like a, maybe half an hour. Yeah, 30 minutes. I am eating very slowly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, but anyways, you have to work. I understand. Okay, very good. Continue, please, with the rest of the questions. Okay. Uh, hello, Araceli, Gabby. I'm sorry for the question. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Gavita. How are you? Hey, Giovanni is here. Welcome back, Giovanni. Are you <laughs> Giovanni? Hello. No here, uh, Giovanni. Hi, Giovanni. Good to see you again. Okay. Thank you. Long vacations, Giovanni. Long vacations. <laughs> okay. Do you have the questions, Gabby? Mm, no. No. It's no. Okay. You don't have the questions. Please take the take the the, the screenshot, please. Well, Exa sent the questions to the WhatsApp group. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. um, Check over there the, the questions. Yes, Araceli? The last question. Mm -hmm. This is optional. But remember, related to food. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh, related to food. For example, do you like, Araceli, do you like vegetarian food? Mm, yes, I like vegetarian food. Okay. Would you be a vegetarian all your life? What do you think? No chicken, no meat? No. <laughs> no rice. No. no. <laughs> okay, very good. And you, Gabby, would you be vegetarian all your life? Um, no, I don't. <laughs> but, I, I, but I like the vegetables. Ah, okay. Yeah, me too. No. I like the vegetables, uh -huh. but I wouldn't like to live all my life without. No. no. I, because I like chicken so much. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and fish. Uh, and chicken, uh, buffalo. Oh, yes, the buffalo wings <laughs> and chunks and everything. No, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be a good vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyways, well, it's difficult. I have a friend and uh, she became a uh, vegan, no vegetarian, vegan. What is the difference between vegetarian and vegan? Vegan people don't eat anything related to food, to, 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 to animals. For example, eggs, okay. Um, bread, no come pan. She doesn't eat bread, normal bread, and she said, "Why? It's que tiene huevo, miss." Ah, okay. <laughs> Pancakes, no. no. <laughs> okay, uh, really? nothing. And so I said, uh, and and one day she asked me to go to a vegan uh, restaurant. I said, "Okay, vamos a comer ahí en el monte." <laughs> Okay, here in El Salvador. Guys. Yes, here in El Salvador. Uh, she has about six years being vegan, but she uh -huh. doesn't eat nothing like related to, to, to animals. Nothing, even candies. She, uh -huh. she doesn't eat candies because they have artificial flavors and blah, blah. She doesn't eat, for example, eh, for breakfast, los frijoles son very black, sin aceite, sin aceite, nothing. I mean, because the, the oil, it, it is, you know, there is a process and blah, 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 blah. So I went to a vegetarian vegan with hair. Believe me, guys, the food was extremely delicious. I really? Oh, my God. Yo le dije, oh, si yo comiera eso todos los días, me hago vegan. Yeah, believe me, guys, the, the, unos pancakes, very, very delicious. Y le digo, but pancakes from, from, from what brand? No, 100% natural. So they have their own food. It's expensive mm, because it's uh -huh. expensive, yes. But, uh, but anyways, it's a matter of life, okay? So she says so. Okay, she she doesn't have any kind of she doesn't take aspirins 
when she has headaches or problems, or, uh, she doesn't take anything because it uh, um, affects, you know, the, the body in her body or something like that. So she believes that. Okay. So anyways, this is a matter of life. That's it. Now, my friends, uh, if you finish the question, well, you can ask Giovanni uh, the questions. Gabby, we, you can we're ask. We're going to finish. Ah, okay. Go over, please. Okay, that's it. Go over the next question. Araceli, please ask the other question. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> Ah, uh, eh, the last one to to Gabby. Okay, uh -huh. Uh -huh. very good. Do you, do you like Italian food? Mm, yes, I like Italian food. I like pasta. <laughs> mm -hmm. I like pizza. Pizzas. Pizzas. Calzones. I see. <laughs> they are delicious. They are very yes, delicious. very delicious. I love pizza. Okay. I, I, I like pizza. Mm -hmm. uh, not that much, okay, but but I prefer the 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 the, the homemade pizzas. Oh, the 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 crispy oh, the pizza crispy. Oh, it's very pizza. delicious. Yes, they are very thin, right, Gabby? They are yes, thin, yes, right? yes. I I I I didn't know about the restaurant Charlie Boys. <laughs> One day I went to that restaurant and I was oh, that's my favorite restaurant for pizza. It's very delicious. Too. A lot, a lot. Mm -hmm. very yes. Delicious. Okay, so Araceli, you can take notes about Gabby's answer. She loves pizzas, okay? Her favorite restaurant, that would be one of them, one of the favorite ones. Okay, very good, girls. Continue, please. Let me check okay. the other guys if they have finished. Okay. Pistachio. Or pistachio. Yes. Pistachio. Pistachio. Uh, pistachio. No. The, the pronunciation, pistachio. Pistachio. Pistachio, mm -hmm. pistachio or vanilla. Oh, but ah, oh, ice cream. You're talking about ice cream. Yes. You love ice cream. <laughs> Chocolate ice cream. Ili, what about you? And uh, I like dessert, but I don't usually eat them because it gives me headache. Oh, really? And yes, but uh, all the I like desserts, Ili. All the desserts. Desserts are. Uh, Sweet, sweetie, muy dulce. Like cheesecakes. Maybe brownie or or desserts. Maybe chocolate, chocolate desserts. So, Ily, that means that you have you have migraine. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, that's the reason, the chocolate. This uh -huh. is the reason, but I like maybe cheesecake, mm -hmm. ice cream. Ah, okay. Yeah. Maybe not too sweet, right? Not too sweet. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. Continue, please. <laughs> yeah. uh, I... You have a dog there too, really? <laughs> Oh my god, you have a lot of pets. Do you like <laughs> American pets. food? Uh, yes, I like, like uh, maybe hamburgers, I like hot dogs mm -hmm. and pizza. And pizza, very good. And, mm -hmm. and me too, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> I like Okay, I, I thought, you know, in the past, I thought that burritos were American, but no, they are not American. <laughs> they are not American. Uh-huh. Okay. And do you like the spicy food? No. I don't like and recite spicy. Spicy recipes. Spicy re uh, receta. Receta. Recipe. Recipe. Uh, spicy recipes. I don't like. I hate the spicy recipes. Oh really? Okay. Yes, because 
is is bad for my colon. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. So don't eat that. <laughs> yeah. I can die, teacher. <laughs> oh no! Don't tell me. Really? Yes, it's oh very God. very dangerous for me. So. Oh, no. okay. Now I understand that. Uh huh. So I understand. This is because I like the the sweet like ice cream. <laughs> uh huh. Ah, okay. Very good. Sometimes, you know, um, well, in my case, I cannot eat spicy food uh, because I get uh, reddish lips. Oh. I don't know. They, they, they are like... Uh, like allergy. Kind of allergy. Uh -huh. So I, I, I oh. prefer not to because I feel uncomfortable. Hey, Itzel is here. Okay. Let's see. Itzel has joined the, the class right now. Okay. Oh. And she is gonna be here with us for a moment. Okay, that's it. Okay. okay. Continue, girls. Hi, Itzel. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Hi. How are you, Itzel? Fine. Okay, pretty good. That's nice to hear from you. That's nice. Okay, they are working right now in some questions. Okay, that's okay. it. Uh huh. Okay and. Okay, finish, uh, finish, finish, Capitan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, very good. No, yeah. no. No, no yet? Okay, no, don't yet. worry, don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. In the, uh, I asked Giovanni. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. Okay. Um, what do you like to have for a snack? Uh, you don't need, right? What do you like, sir? What do you like, I teacher? <laughs> so, what do you like to have for a snack? For a snack, uh -huh. he don't he don't eat a snack. No way. A yes. Candies or something? No, an apple? <laughs> no, nothing. What do you like to have for a snack? Uh -huh. mm, I like um, churritos. <laughs> chips. Chistoso. Uh -huh. Chips. Chips. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, it it like includes everything. Uh -huh. Fruit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Um, but in the question, okay, guys, finish. Vero, finish, and Juan Carlos, hello, Sophie and Brendita. No, no, teacher, no, teacher, no, okay. Eh, en el caso de Sophie and Brenda, como se conectaron hasta después, pues quizás no van a poder terminar con ellos, okay? That's it. Pero entre Verónica y Juan Carlos, ¿en qué question are you? Uh, 12. The number 12. Oh, almost finishing. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, very good. Well, uh, the time is over. Leave it there. Okay, ahí déjenlo. Okay, leave it there because we need to check the answers. Okay? Okay, teacher. That's it. Okay, very good, guys. We're going to come back to the main session. Morning. Hello, Blanquita. Good morning. How are you, Blanquita? Welcome to the class. Thanks. Okay, that's it. Well, the other guys are coming back to the main station. That's it. Very good. Um, obviously, not, not everybody finished, okay? Because some of them were joining the class later, okay? And there were, there were, uh, 14 questions, right? About 14 or 13. Okay, so that's why we, we but, but we have some information already, okay? We're going to start with Juan Carlos. Okay, Juan Carlos, can you please tell me uh, some information? I want you to grab, ustedes coja, choose, grab, okay? Um, about, uh, let me see, three, three or four questions, okay? And give me the report, okay, for, for, for your partner. Okay, you don't have to, you don't have to give me all the answers, okay, for the 14 questions, but choose, select, 
Okay, three or four, the most important answers that you collected from, from your partners, okay? Let's start with you, Frank Carlos. What do you have from Veronica? Okay. Uh, to Veronica, hmm? uh, she likes Mexican food. Okay. Uh, she usually eat breakfast in the morning before work every day. Okay. Uh, she eats dinner at uh, 8 p.m., but regularly, uh, maybe one a week, she eats dinner at 10 p.m. 10 p.m. Um, wow, once a week at 10 p.m., very late. Uh -huh. He like cooking because it's relaxing for her. Oh, nice, Veronica. Uh -huh. Like Eliana. Um, <laughs> because um, it's relaxing. <laughs> for Eli, yes. no, it's a stressing. Uh -huh. And the last one, Juan Carlos? And she favorite dessert is flan de coco. Because oh, it's very oh, delicious man. for her. Okay, great. Okay, delicious, but oh, very good election. Huh? Very good election. Okay, excellent. That's it. Uh, let's see, Gabby, please. Tell me. Tell me, Gabby, about your partner. Okay, Giovanni. Okay. Um, uh, uh, her favorite food is hamburger. Uh -huh. He loves onion, cheese, and meat. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. uh, uh, he don't eat a uh, snack. He doesn't? He doesn't eat a uh, snack, only the meal. And he loves cheesecake. Mm -hmm. mm, okay. We have Your favorite dessert is cheesecake. Cheesecake, okay. His favorite dessert is cheesecake, okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. Delicious, very good, very nice, okay. Sinia, can you please tell me about your partner? Good morning. Hello, Sinia. And my partner, and two partners. Two partners, Exa okay. Exa and Dalila. Uh -huh. yes. Choose one, please. Um, Exa. Okay. Uh, and my partner usually uh, time have time have dinner at eight or seven p.m. P.m. Okay. Uh huh. Yes. The I like cooking. He like you or he? No, he. Sorry. Uh, he likes he cooking. Like cooking. Mm -hmm. Yes. And he he eating slowly. Oh really? He really. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I like the coffee. Oh, he likes the coffee. Okay, a uh, black coffee, Mister, or with milk or cream or something. Black coffee. Black without coffee. sugar. Oh my God! Really, without sugar, bitter like that? Oh God. Yes. <laughs> okay, my 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 sister likes coffee like that exactly like you. Okay, I I I don't drink coffee that much, but. If, I drink coffee, I have to drink it with cream, okay? Otherwise, it's difficult for me to drink it. Okay, that's nice. Thank you, Sinia, very good. And my friend, let me see, Carlita, please. Okay. Can you please tell me about your partner, Ili? Okay. Um, Ili, what else, what else? Number three. Okay. Uh -huh. What do you usually have for breakfast? Mm -hmm. She told me that um, she usually eats uh, beans, eggs, 
coffee with milk and this is like a um a normal breakfast a normal breakfast okay For very her. typical mm -hmm. huh? salvadorian uh -huh. very yes. yes very good and how many questions three three give me oh, three okay. answers mm -hmm. um the number one mm -hmm. pretty full and um, illy tell me that uh, she likes pupusas like a uh, uh, very typical. Mm -hmm. Very good. <laughs> hey, hey, Carlita, Ileana is 100% Salvadorian. Right? Pupusas. Ash, <laughs> typical, yes. Typical, <laughs> typical breakfast. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, and tell me the last one, please. And the last one. Um, Okay, um, for the eat cell, mm -hmm. you eat quickly or slowly. And okay. Mm -hmm. She told us that she, she eat slowly. Oh, she eats slowly. Okay, very and good. Really, and me too. <laughs> and okay, well, this is good. Ah, uh, when you eat yes. fast, it's difficult for your di digestion, right? But anyways, okay. Thank you, Carlita. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very nice. Okay, guys. Well, you had a moment for practicing with your partners about your eating habits, you know, etc. And uh, uh, you could listen to your partner saying if the person uh, ate uh, very late okay slow fast what kind of food they ate etc etc okay and then we're gonna base those answers on this topic okay because today as i said we are going to learn how to express suggestions esta es la tarea 2.5 así que ahora se transforma a la otra tarea hoy si la pueden hacer okay in your in your platform that's it my friends Expressing suggestions, okay? So what are we gonna use for expressing suggestions in this case? Well, for expressing suggestions, guys, you have a different um, uh, structures, okay? Uh, oof, uh, some, some, some months ago, in basic, we practice, you should, I recommend, okay? But there are other kind of uh, structures that you have to follow in order to express suggestions to someone, okay? The first one is this one. This is the first structure. Look, we are gonna use would be better, would be better. So we have the subject, okay? Este es lo principal, sujeto, okay, subject. Okay, then guys, you have to use would be better. Okay, este no lo pueden cambiar. Okay, would be better. Okay, would be better. And then you have to use the infinitive. Ah, what is infinitive, teacher? Aquel que lleva tú, se acuerda? To go, to drink, to need, to sleep, to uh, eat, to study, etc. Okay, todos los que llevan el tú. Okay, so this is the first structure that I have for you. Subject would be better infinitive. Pero en sujeto, okay, usted me le va a poner el it. Okay? No, he, he would be better to, okay, in this case, it, it, it. Okay, so the expression we have the number one, okay. Gavita, can you read the number one, please, example? Okay, it would be better to study in the morning. Very good. It would be better to study. Bueno, sería mejor. This is like in Spanish, we want to say sería. Mira, sería bueno. <laughs> okay, itzel, sería bueno que me mande un delivery. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> in English, that would be, ¿cómo sería en inglés, itzel? Sería bueno que le mande un delivery la teacher. Ajá, <laughs> ajá. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So, what is it? It would be better to send, to uh -huh. send, send, send uh -huh. delivery to the, <laughs> to the teacher. Uh -huh. to the teacher. Uh -huh. Very good. That's it. Great. So, other, it's a, sería bueno, sería bueno este, eh, que, 
dormirnos temprano. How would you say that, Itzel? It would be better to sleep early. Early, excellent, very good. That's it, it would be better to sleep. Look, in this case, in color purple, I'm, I'm showing you the infinitive, okay? To study, to stay, to attend, okay? Number two, Gabby, please, number two and number three. Thank you, Itzel, very good. Uh, it would be better to stay home. Mm, this is for this pandemic, uh-huh, number three. <laughs> It would be better to attend the meeting. The meeting, very good. Let's change the meeting. It would be better to attend classes uh -huh. every day, okay? Late, but attend, okay? So you see, this is the structure that you have to find. It would be better. No me voy a poner, it would to be better. It would better to be, no. This is the structure. Look, subject. And in this case, you have to use it would be better. This is the phrase that you have to use. And then the infinitive, okay? So, and then we have it like a question. Mira, no sería mejor que... Ah, when you are very good friends and you want to give suggestions to someone, mire, Ili, no sería mejor que, I don't know, no, no sería mejor que, 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 uh, que trabaje, que trabaje de, de noche. <laughs> okay? So, it's expression, okay? When you say, no sería mejor si, right? So, you say like this, negative, look, wouldn't. Wouldn't it be better to, in then, the structure, okay? Examples, wouldn't it be better to stay home? Wouldn't it be better to eat healthy? In this case, for example, if I am, if I am saying Juan Carlos, right? Juan Carlos is eating a lot of junk food every day. He doesn't go to the gym. So it's a, hey, Juan Carlos, wouldn't it be better to eat healthy food? I'm giving a suggestion. This is not like you have to do it. No, this is a suggestion, okay? In this case, wouldn't it be better to? This is the question, my friends, okay? And the other way is, it would be better to study. It would. This is not a question. This is a question. So when you have a question, you have to start with, wouldn't it be? Wouldn't it be better, okay? Wouldn't it be better in negative, okay? This is in negative, that's it. This is the first structure that I have for you, okay? But I have the other uh, other expressions to provide suggestions, right? Would you prefer, okay? Would you prefer to have money or health? Sophie, this is for you. Would you prefer to have money or health? Um, I prefer have health. Okay, very good. Well, you see, this is a, okay, for alternatives. Aquí ya no son sugerencias, sino que son alternatives, right? Would you prefer to eat here or there? Mm -hmm. I prefer to eat there. Okay, let's go, right? So, would you prefer? This is one. Esa es esa para sugerencias, right? This is suggestions. I, it would be better and wouldn't it be better, okay? And these are for alternatives, okay? Would you prefer to? Look, you have to después del prefer, okay? No van a decir, would you prefer, would you prefer it here or there? No, you have to use to, okay? Okay, just to separate, okay? Prefer and the following verb, right? And the other one is assistant la plataforma, this is structure, okay. Así se la van a aprender, right? This is this expression, right? It would be good if. Sería bueno si. It would be good if. It would be good if. But here, guys, you have to pay attention. The subject here, it is optional. I, she, they, we, okay, etc. But pay attention. The verb is in past tense, okay? Look, the verb is in past tense. 
No in past participle, no in present, no, in past. For example, we have Franklin, my friend. Can you please uh, read the example, Franklin? It would be, uh, example, uh, number one, it would be good if she had a second house. Yo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Number two? It would be good if you stood Study the verb uh, in past. Uh -huh. um, it would be good if they worked on Saturdays. Okay, very good. So you will see if you are going to use this structure, guys, you have to use the verb in past. Bueno, sería bueno que ella tuviera. Sería bueno que ella estudiase. O sería bueno que ellos trabajaran, right? It would be good. Si le quiere decir a su hermano, mira, sería bueno que hicieras limpieza. <laughs> okay. How would you say that? <laughs> Pero con su hermano, aunque okay, sería bueno que hicieras limpieza. <laughs> How would you say that, Pero, in English? It would be good if um, you clean the house. Very good. In ese cleaned, quiero que me le haga cleaned. Clean. Excellent. Clean the house. Cleaned, ajá, porque con ese sonido yo estoy sabiendo que usted lo usó en pasado, ¿ok? Cleaned. It would be okay better if you clean the house, ¿ok? That. For example, other, other, other suggestions here. Let me see, let me check here. Araceli, for example. Araceli would be, it would be good, it would be good if you, ¿ve? If you um, spoke English with your partners. Okay, you see, the verb is in past, okay? That's it. It would be good if, it would be good if the subject plus the verb in past tense, okay? Worked, studied, and had, okay? That's it, okay? Questions? Questions with this? This is this is only to follow the structure, okay? When you have the structure, then you have to give me recommendations, okay? For this. Now we're gonna work, okay? But before we start, it's time for the attendance, guys. So everybody, okay, turn on your cameras because I'm going to start, okay? Uh, calling you by your name. That's it, let's start with the first one, okay? Carla Beatriz Aguilar Marroquín. Present. Excellent. Verónica Beatriz Elso de Saldana. Here, teacher. <clears throat> Great. Osmani Etzaú de León Hernández. Present. Great. Eh, Vania Itzel Deras de Cañas. Present, teacher. Great, Itzel. Blanca Estela Marroquín Ramírez. Present. Ok, Blanquita, welcome. Franklin de Thank Jesús you. Martínez. Present. Great, Frank. Giovanni Alberto Orantes Flores. Present. Great, uh, Giovanni, welcome back. Dalila Estela Silva Morán. Present teacher. Okay, there you are, Dalila. Thank you. Maria Araceli González Flores. Present. Very good. Cynia Elizabeth Mejía de Sanabria. Present teacher. Nice. <laughs> Sofía Guadalupe Hernández. Present. Ah, okay, Sophie. Okay, Juan Carlos Molina Martinez. Present teacher. Claudia Eliana Casun de Mengíbar. Present. Brenda Lucía Rosales Guzmán. Present teacher. Brendita, hello, Brendita. José Enrique Bermúdez Rivera. Absent. Ay, ah, yo dije, si tenemos full house, les mando algo a sus casas. Ok. Gabriela, <laughs> Gabriela Beatriz right. Ramírez. Ay, present. Ok, present. Very good. Oscar Xavier Morales. Ay, ok. okay. Ahí le llaman que por culpa de ella. <laughs> en Carlita mm -hmm. Joana Martínez de Martínez. Present. Ok, very good. I welcome back. Ok, that's it. My friends, there we go. Okay, now we're gonna practice. Okay, giving suggestions. Okay, wouldn't it be better? Let me let me show you the the phrases once again. Okay, just to if you wanna make a screenshot. Okay, 
this, this is the first one. Okay, subject would be better plus infinitive. Okay, then we have this one. It would be good if the subject and the verb in past. Okay, these are for il y las negativas en pregunta, right? Wouldn't it be better to? Okay, this is the other structure that you have to use. Okay, this is what you are gonna do. Okay, I uh, I'm going to assign right now. We have make three suggestions about the following context. Okay, <clears throat> three suggestions per topic. Okay, here at work, in your house, plans with your friends, in an English class. Okay, here you have four, okay, four, four topics. Choose two, selecciona tres, uh, sorry, two, okay, choose two. At work and um, plans with your friends, or in your house and at work, okay, in an English class, I don't know, you choose two, okay, there you go. You're gonna work in pairs, Choose to and make three suggestions using the different structures. No usen solo una estructura, no, use the three structures, okay? For example, in an English class, mm, okay, uh, wouldn't it be good if, uh, no, let me check. Uh, speak English with your partner, okay, or practice English with your partner. And then you have to choose one structure, okay? And then you say, well, it would be better. Okay, no, 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 with questions, okay. Wouldn't it be better to practice English with your partner? Okay, you have number one. At home, mm, at home. Eh, bueno, sería bueno si, si te levantaras temprano. Ah, it would be better to get up early, for example, in this case. And then if you want to use the simple past, okay, here, it would be a good, it would be good, it would be good if you, for example, at work, it would be, be it would be good if you, um, let me see, uh, if you have, okay, a, a little break, Okay, between your uh, working hours. That's it. I am expressing here suggestions. Okay, remember. So choose two, please, at work, at home, plans with your friends. Cuando hacen planes, mira, no sería bueno ir al parque. Okay, no, 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 Okay, then you say that. Okay, make three with your partners. Please copy the sentences in your notebooks and then we're going to check it together because at 7.30, more or less, guys, we are going to start with the presentations. Okay, there we go. Uh, accept the invitation once again, please. And you are going to work, in this case, you're going to work in pairs. Creo que algunos van a estar en trios. Okay, that's it. Please accept the invitation right now. Hello, teacher. Hello, girls. Okay. Do you have your two alternatives? At work, what is the other? Uh, plans with your friends. And the other is um, in your house. Okay. And the other one is in an English class. Uh -huh. Select two, please. At work, sorry. At work. And the other is? In an English class. Okay, very good. Nice. Very nice. Chris. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, Itzel. Tell me. Um, Do you need the, the, the PPT? 
The picture. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. in, in the structures. Yeah. No, okay. no, no. The... Ah, the topics. Here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Choose two itself. Work, plans, English class, or in your house. Choose only two. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. That's it. And make suggestions, please. Very good. Continue. Thank you. Hello, hello, Franklin, Gabby, and Sinia. Uh -huh. did, did you choose the two categories there? Uh, only one. Okay, which is the first one? Uh, plan with your friends. Okay, very good. Uh -huh. Plans with your friends. Excellent. Uh -huh. Bye. Uh, it would be better. It's, it would be better to to go in the cinema. No, eh, Pero lleva infinity. Ah, uh -huh, to go. To go. Uh -huh, to go to the cinema. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. To the cinema, yes. Uh -huh. Cinema. Would it be better to get up early? To arrive. No sería, will, will it better to. No, because it's a question. No, me estás preguntando. Yes, it's a question. It's a, it's a wouldn't, uh -huh. wouldn't, it, wouldn't it be better better to get up early? It's a question. Uh, would it better to early? Yes. No, en this case, eh, Jova, eh, aunque sea pregunta, es, es una sugerencia. No se tienen que responder. No, no se tienen eh. que responder. No, 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 no. This ah. is only to make suggestion. Es como que usted le diga a su hermano, digamos, hey, mira, Juan, no sería mejor que trabajara. Juan le va a responder enojado, feliz, no uh -huh, sé. No pero... creo que... Ok, <laughs> so that's why, that's why I'm telling you, ok. No, no, no necesito una respuesta estructurada, ok. La que tienen que estructurar es la pregunta, ok. Porque con esto usted está diciendo, está sugiriendo algo. Teacher, no sería mejor que, que trabajáramos en, en Google Classroom, por ejemplo. Uh -huh. Entonces usted me dice, teacher, wouldn't it be better to work at, eh, in Google Classroom? Pero yo no le voy a responder, yes, I would, o oh, no. Ahí yo uh -huh. le respondo como cualquier otra. Ok, oh, thank It's you. It's crazy, man. Uh, oh, no, I don't like Google Classroom. Oh, oh, no, I don't know. Ok, that's it. Okay. Just make the questions, that's it. Okay, and the number three, I I write. It would be better to study class after work. It's going to be better to study English class after work. Sí, ¿verdad? Y dame otra. Este otro. And they could prefer it to meet people to The homework. 
One word. It would it would be no, it would be better. Mm -hmm. Better to do the homework, the English homework, the English homework. After to have the class. In that case, Sophie, pongale after having o finishing the class. Uh -huh. Hay una regla que dice que después de la palabra after o before, el verbo va con ing. After. So after, mm -hmm. after finishing the class, after having the class, after taking the class, etc. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Continue, please. After. After to okay. finishing. Quítale, quítale el tú. Okay. After finishing. Uh -huh. After finishing the class. Finishing the class. Uh -huh. Exactly. Okay, very good. Continue, please. Mm -hmm. um, Questions? I think that um, teacher is correct if mm -hmm. I if I say, for example, um, uh, talking about the 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 um, work, no? Uh, no, no, no. In an English class. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tell me. It would be good if I write the most difficult phrases of the class. Mm -hmm. It would be. Who if I? Aquí, or, ajá, if I, or if I have good, to... If I, y el verbo en pasado, Carlita. Ah, ajá, I, if I... What is the past, past tense of right? Rock. Rock, excellent. Ajá, can you please repeat the sentence now? It will be good if I wrote the most difficult phrases of the class. Excellent, perfect. Mm -hmm. So, siempre que usen ese if, acuérdense del verbo en past tense, ok? Mm -hmm. That's okay. it, esa es la, la clave. If, if I wrote, if I spoke, if I did, if I finished, etc., etc., ok? Teacher, mm -hmm. pero no. Uh -huh. um, I have the three sentences for two options. I work at work in uh, English class. Okay, can you read? Three, uh, uh -huh. three please. Yes, yeah, three. Okay, at work, for example, it will be better to get early in the morning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't it better to work from home? Okay. Would you prefer to have laptop or desktop computer? Excellent, very good. Mm -hmm. It would be good if you sent them email this morning. Okay, sent. Conté, sent. ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, sent. sent. Very good. Send the email this morning. This morning. Mm -hmm. Only. Only that. Very good. Only. Excellent. Uh -huh. the okay, very good. Excellent. Very nice. Remember, you have two categories, three sentences. So at the end, six in total. Teacher, okay. I have the others. Uh -huh. The other for in the English class. Okay, read, read, read yours. I would be better to get a good dictionary. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, wouldn't it be better to study the class in your free time? Okay, that is a question, right, Carlita? Yes. Ah, pues, hágame la compuesta. Wouldn't to, it be better to... To study the class in free time? Very good. Uh huh. Uh, would you would you prefer to study at morning 
or at night. <laughs> okay. In the morning. The morning. Or at night. Night. Excellent. Very good. Continue. Uh, the last is the 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 sentences that I ah, I wrote right. If, uh -huh. if uh -huh. okay, excellent. Okay, very good. You are done. Okay, nice. Let me check the other guys. Okay. Okay. Very Thank nice. You, teacher. Very good. Thanks. Okay. Do you have questions, guys? Ay, sí, con esta de la pregunta estamos algo perdida. Ok, 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 tell me. Uh -huh. Es que habíamos agarrado una, una oración, pero creo que no nos fluía mucho. <risa> <risa> ok, ¿cuál es la categoría de ustedes? Home, work, eh, English class o, o plans with friends? A, eh, inicialmente habíamos escogido in your home mm -hmm. y plan with your friends. With your friends, ok. Ajá, pero eh, plan with your friends no nos no, no fluye. Oh, no, no se les ocurre qué. Ok, bueno, well, por ejemplo, si usted está hablando con su amigo y le quiere sugerir algo, le puede decir, por ejemplo, usan la primera estructura. Ok, mira, sería mejor que vayamos a galerías. Un ejemplo, ¿ve? It would be better to go to galerías. ¿Ve? Usted está dando una sugerencia de ir a algún lado con su amigo, right? Eh, si lo hacen negativo con esa pregunta, wouldn't it be better to? Usted puede decir, eh, for example, um, eh, wouldn't it be better to go to the beach? Eh, no sería mejor ir a la playa. Ok. So, esas sugerencias que hacemos con nuestros amigos, right? Ok. Mm -hmm. Si usted quiere usar la otra de prefer, que le di, que tienen alternativa. Póngale, would you prefer to eat buffalo wings or campero chicken? <laughs> ok, that's it. Así está, ok. Así se hace, ok. Ok, gracias. Gracias, teacher. Try, try. Intenten ahorita, ok. Vaya. Hello, girls. Uh -huh. Any questions? Uh, uh, the past, uh, the pair in past, uh, get up. Got up, got up, and, and it will be good if you got up early. Early, mm -hmm. got excellent. Mm -hmm. got, got up, up early. Mm -hmm. And it will be better to have a break. It's correct. To have a break. Uh huh. To have right. a break. Uh -huh. ah, okay. In your relationship. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh huh. Very good. Okay. Finish. Finish. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Nice. Let me check the other guys if they already finished, and I will come back with you. Okay. Yeah. Finish, my friends. Yes. Yes. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Let me check the other guys, and then we will come back to the main session. Finish, guys. I know. No. Okay. ¿Dónde van ahorita? Son seis por todas, pero no. Seis, tres y tres. Ajá. Three. Ah, no faltan dos. Okay. No faltan dos. ¿Cuál categoría? Which category did you choose? In your house. In your house, ah, okay. Uh -huh. Ah, in English class, in, in your house. Okay, you finish in the English class? Yes. Okay, so yes. now in your house? Yes. Okay, yes. that's it. What do you have, the number one in your house? It would be better to do exercise every day. Okay, very good. Pongan, sería bueno que le ayudaras a tu mamá. <laughs> que ayude a cocinar. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, <laughs> do it, okay? In your house, right? Okay, otra cosa que hay en la casa, right? <laughs> que le dice a su mamá, a veces. Shh, vaya, Juan Carlos. Mm -hmm. No sería bueno, Juan Carlos, que. <laughs> okay, que saliera, le. <laughs> Solo tirado en la sofá, right? Uh, so, stuff like that, suggestions, remember. Mm -hmm. 
suggestions. Okay. Wouldn't it be good? Wouldn't it be good if, okay, or you say, would it, would it, would it be? The idea is to use, ocupen uno con if, para que vean, usen el verbo en pasado, okay? The okay. if structure, for example, this one, eh, the last one, la última que vimos, this one. It would be good if, ve? Sería bueno que ayudaras a tu mamá, right? So, it would be good if you helped your mother. Cooking, all right? <laughs> if you helped your mother, okay, in the kitchen, for example, right? So, this is another one. Mm -hmm. So, remember the verb in past, okay? Finish one more because the other guys already finished, okay? Les doy un minuto. <laughs> okay, Let's see you later, later guys. <laughs>
to have a party in your house. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, would you prefer to drink coffee or milk? Okay, very good. And the other, I don't know, it's okay. That's okay, tell me. I can, uh -huh. Would you prefer to watch the movie or to eat diner, dinner in your house? Excellent, very good, excellent, okay. To watch a movie or eat dinner in your house. Ah, with Netflix included. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, very good, it's an excellent. Franklin. Hi. Uh, selection category, uh, plan with your friends. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, it would be better to go to the cinema. Mm -hmm. uh, would it be better to meet at restaurant? Restaurant? Restaurant. Uh -huh, it's a question. Yes. Uh -huh. It's a question, yes. Um, would you prefer to out at the mountain or beach? Oh, okay. Ahí en, antes de out, póngale el verbo go. To go out to the to mountain or the beach. Okay. okay. Very good. Excellent. Next. Uh, next, uh, the category in your house. In your house, okay. Yes, um, it would be good if me <laughs> took a shower before to class to the class. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> took a shower before the class, very good. Uh huh. I yeah. no. uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> it's number two. It's would be better. <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, it's it would be better to clean the house. The house, uh huh. Uh, would would wouldn't wouldn't it be better to prepare the breakfast early? Okay, very good. Wouldn't it be better to prepare the breakfast early? Uh huh. Great. Okay. Yes. Very, very, very good. That's it. Following the structures, guys. This is la clave. Follow the structures. Okay. That's it. Ahí en la plataforma hay ejercicios de scramble sentences. So you have to put the words in the correct order. But please check the structure at the moment. Okay. Or you remember the phrase? Don't worry, okay? We are done with that. This is another way, guys, you learn how to give suggestions, okay? Para que no solamente diga you should, you should, you should, okay? Suggestions. Remember, if the answer is optional, okay? If you accept it or not, that's it, okay? Well, guys, some of you had uh, the presentation yesterday, so we're going to continue with this, and we're going to finish with it. We have Araceli Dalila. It's Ellen Juan Carlos, okay, the people that were uh, yesterday in the class. So you have the opportunity today to, okay, to express your opinions about your favorite restaurant. So we are going to start, okay, with uh, Juan Carlos. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, okay, very good, Juan Carlos. You can display if you have the presentation, please. Let's pay attention to Juan Carlos and then uh, please, uh, Itzel, you're ready, Itzel, after Juan Carlos, get ready with the presentation, please. Then we have uh, Dalila, okay? And finally, we have Araceli. Okay, Juan Carlos. Okay. Ya pueden ver, sí. Yes, of course. I don't have a favorite restaurant, but I like to buy in Papayons. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, the founder of the restaurant was John Schnauter. Uh, they started selling pizzas in his father's taggers. Oh. Uh, he saw his Camaro so he could buy kitchen equipment uh, and he founded the restaurant in 1984. Uh, why do I buy in Papayons? Uh, because I love pizza, 
they make good pizza and the rest restaurant is comfort comfortable and looks clean. Mm -hmm. I usually buy at the a pop up restaurant before the pandemic. I use it to go with my family or my girlfriend. Uh, no. We bought one pizza, patroques, or, or garlic, garlic, no. Garlic bread. Now, uh, now we only buy online. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. the, the restaurant menu is very varied. The, the restaurant menu, menu is very varied. Uh, you can find pizzas, dessert, pastas, and other food and they, hide, they have different price. For example, the, the price of the pizza depends on the, of the size. Uh, the phone number is double, double two seven three uh, thirty three thirty three. Uh, the website is papayons that's it. Okay, very good, Juan Carlos. Nice, thank you. Very, very good. Okay, that's it. Hey, I didn't know the founder, the founder of Papa John's. Okay, very nice. I didn't know about it. That's good, you know. It started a, as a family business. Okay, very good. Nice. Equipment, Juan Carlos. La pronunciación de equipo. Equipment. Equipment, ok. Equipment. La palabra confortable o cómodo es, no es comfortable, es comfortable. Ok. Comfortable. Oh. Eh, eh, aunque va la palabra table ahí, no es table como mesa, sino que travel. Comfortable. Ok. That's it. Very, yeah, very nice. Okay. Very good. Good. Ok, next please, itself. Activate your microphone, please. Sorry. Wait a minute, please, porque esto me abruma. Y hay algo que se llama share. Un, algo verdecito. Bueno, a mí me sale color verde. Espero que ustedes estén bien. Ajá. Y ahí le da clic y ahí le va a aparecer la diapositiva que ya tiene abierta. Ahí está. Very good, Itzel. Okay. Uh -huh. Can you see? Yes. China walk. Okay, good. Okay. Uh, I will talk about my favorite, my favorite restaurant. Uh -huh. And um, my favorite restaurant. It's China wood. It's China wood. Because the food is delicious and they have variety in your food. Mm -hmm. In the food? In the food. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, the kind of menu is uh, orange, um, chicken, and red chicken. And, and there's the chicken, Cantonese rice, uh, chow mein, and beef with the veg vegetables, and ham and cheese roll, chicken rolls. Etc. Mm -hmm. The prices of the China walk are from to five dollars to eight dollars. Okay, it's not very expensive, yeah. right? It's a... no, it's um, accessible. Mm -hmm. uh, additional. They have contained the economic combo 
that your price is three ninety nine. Mm -hmm. And uh, so uh, combos, familiar combos. Uh, that your price is from ten ninety nine to twenty four dollars. Mm -hmm. This is a, 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 a banquet for five people. And yes, oh, five yes, people I see and eight people. Eight, mm -hmm. Yes, eight people, uh, four people. Uh, uh, it depends. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, the some curiosities of a uh, China book are uh, they start they are started no sorry they started uh -huh. they started open in 1999 in El Salvador ah okay yes uh, other is they use a famous utensil called wok Mm -hmm. To prepare food. Ah, there's the name. Wok. Yes. <laughs> uh, from it comes his name. Ah, okay, great. And uh, finally, uh, the vision of creating a business of Chinese food of high quality. Uh, be combining or combining, I don't know, these characteristics of fast food international. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, actually, uh, they uh, work with deliveries only or um, drive in mm -hmm. yes because of the problems that we are having right yes okay uh, for a pandemia uh, they work this okay good okay nice very complete okay. hey very very interesting facts okay nice very good finish right miss yes okay thank you very good. Nice, it's it. Thank you very much. Okay, good. Thank China you. walk. Yeah, I, I love China walk, to be honest. <laughs> Let's check the pronunciation here, okay? okay. Negocio, mm -hmm. negocio. Business. Business. Okay. Ah, no, business. Okay. okay, business. El arroz por ahí creo que se le fue. Rice. Okay, rice. rice. Uh -huh. Cantonese, uh, rice. That's it. Eh, la palabra, remember, actually, no es actualmente. Mm -hmm. Así que ahí me le va a poner nowadays. Nowadays, I don't China remember. Walk, uh -huh, yes. <laughs> nowadays, China Walk has delivery, etc. Et ok. Eh, mm -hmm. También repitió como dos, tres veces, your price. El precio. Mm. Pero como si usted dice your price, me está diciendo a mí y a sus compañeros. Tu precio. Mm. <laughs> Pero, mm -hmm. <laughs> so, <Okay. yes. laughs> so you have to say the price, okay? Uh, okay. El precio, the, the price, si, si ponerle posesivo, your, etc., etc., okay? Y eh, mm. otra vez, cuando digamos depend, depende, it depends, la S, okay? Okay, okay. so it depends, mm -hmm. eh, the price, ta 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 Okay, that's it. Very nice. Okay, great. Very good. Okay, Dalila. Okay, your 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 opportunity, please. Okay. Okay, luck. Okay, there you are. Mm -hmm. 
My favorite restaurant in El Salvador is La Calaca. Uh -huh. It's I love Mexican food. I prefer the La Calaca restaurant for accessibility, variety of dishes, sauce, price, delivery, and tasks. And the, uh -huh. the menu is beverage, Cheladas, soda, tomato juice, margarita, appetizer, and su de tortilla soup, uh -huh. chicken soup, and nachos, sopes. Sope. Quite. <laughs> Sopes. Yes. Really? Like the animals. <laughs> Pero si no puse la foto, son... Ah, son ok. Well, oh. de, de masa de, <laughs> de maíz morado. <laughs> ah, ok, ok. No the animal that we have in el sal. <laughs> Parecido. <laughs> ok. Ajá. Uh -huh. I like a uh, esquite, uh -huh. main course, and burritos, quesadillas, gringas, and tacos, tortas, and costa laca, and dessert, and pie de, de cheese pie. The cheese pie, uh huh. Flan and Nutella. Uh huh. Finish. <laughs> how much? How much is the food in La Calaca, eh, Talila? Tacos. Uh -huh. For for four five four or five. $5. Five dollars. Ah, okay. okay. Uh, the, the order of tacos. Yes. Mm, okay, it's not very expensive. Well, but maybe the tacos are three tacos, right? Mm. Or two tacos. How many tacos is the order? Yes, three. three tacos. Three. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. That's three. it. Okay, Mexican food like EXA. Okay, well, EXA and, and Carlita, I think, uh -huh. she likes uh, Mexican food. Well, it's, it's one of my favorite food. And, and, and Dali, do you eat the, the, the Mexican food uh, spicy? Yes, I like it. Oh, really? Oh, my God. Okay, nice. Okay, la calaca, other option, okay, for for uh, going and and have fun, okay, with family or friends, okay? Thank you, Dali, okay? Good effort there. <clears throat> la pronunciación de, 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 de taste, okay? El taste, esa es la pronunciación para decir que son... Eh, rico en sabor, ok, tasty, ok, taste, that's it, the, 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 the stuff there, ok. Eh, me hubiera encantado escuchar más, un poquito más de, de, de quizás la calaca cuando fue fundada, quiénes son los dueños, ok, information about that, para escucharla más hablar, ok, that's it. Eh, but anyways, it was food related, it was uh, the information related to the, to the restaurant, ok. Nice. Then we have Araceli. Okay. Araceli, are you there? Yes. Araceli is there. Yes. Okay. Araceli, what's your favorite restaurant? Okay. I'm going to try. Okay. Así como Itzel, right? Itzel. Do you see? Eh, yes, ahorita se va compartiendo, okay. 
That's it. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, my favorite restaurant. Um, no, no is my favorite restaurant. I I want to talk about it. Okay, very good. Shows delicious. I, yes, because I think it's very complete. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, the um, shows of Basilea restaurant is um, is familiar restaurant. Um, has a good advance has uh, is our bakery mm -hmm. and they make all kinds of chocolate um, chocolate figures including uh, logos of chocolate um, it's a cool place because you can eat outdoors or indoors. Um, how do you prefer? Mm -hmm. um, they provide good service, I think. Um, the food is delicious. Um, do you know the menu? <laughs> Well, I, 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 I know only the, the ice creams and the chocolates, but not the food, Araceli. So this is oh. new for me. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, um, the food is delicious. You can find breakfast. Breakfast uh, and shows. Oh. Yes. Uh, um, American. Breakfast or Mexican or Salvadorian food. Mm -hmm. um, you can find a starter or salad, sandwich or paninis. Oh my God, like for, for lunch, right? Yes, uh -huh. okay, for lunch. Thank you. Um, um, some kind of beverage, uh, a chata, soda, lemonade, a smoothie. Mm -hmm. um, but his specialty is dessert and coffee. And gelato. And gelatos, okay. Excuse me, Araceli, uh, where is it located? Um, this is, um, they, they have uh, five located, I remember. Uh, five? Is, oh, I know only one in Metro Centro. Uh, this, this is one, but the uh -huh. thing that I most rate mm -hmm. is in San Benito. Mm -hmm. The other is Santa Elena and Metro Center. And uh, I forget the other one, but. There are uh, five in total. Okay. Yes. Hmm. But the, uh, the imagine that I presentation now is uh -huh. San Benito. Ah, okay. Oh, it's beautiful. Can you show the picture again? The first picture. Oh, it's in San Benito. It's better. Yes, because in Metro Centro it's very small. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Shows chocolates bakery. Okay, yes. it's so it's true, my friend. It's it's very complete. It's very very complete. Oh, um, here and um, here in this uh, place mm -hmm. has the. Uh, Chocolate 
bakery, uh, no, chocolate factory. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, his specialty, I told you, is dessert, coffee, and gelato. And gelato, excellent. Mm -hmm. You can find cheesecake, uh, cardinals, amaretos, cake, uh, budding, and coffee, uh, coffee express, and they have uh, variety. Mm -hmm. I don't know about reality. And um, you can eat only desserts and coffee, or you can breakfast. You can eat breakfast or lunch. Or right? lunch here. Okay, very good. What about the prices? Mm -hmm. uh, are they accessible, or it's a little expensive? Um, uh, I think it's accessible. Is uh, I think is very economical. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I like the panini. Okay, um, <laughs> yeah, they look delicious. Okay. Um. Finally, you can buy chocolate uh, for to go or for give to someone special. Mm -hmm. You can choose. Um, they have, I don't know if I, I, lo dejé, no de acuerdo. Um, here you can see the mostrador. Mm -hmm. the How counter. do you say? The counter. Counter? Or the show, okay. the, the show and counter. Aha, uh -huh. you can find all the, 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 the chocolates, right? The chocolate, uh, yes. And you can buy bread, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you can buy two. Mm -hmm. Very good. You are right. Uh, and I see the... Very complete. Okay, thank you. I okay. see. <laughs> Great, very good. Nice, Araceli. Okay, very good. Shows, other options, but this is sweet, this is salty, it's a combination of flavors, okay? Very, very nice. I like that, okay? I like, I, I, I like that. I have been there, but only for buying chocolates, but I have never been there for eating the, the food, okay? But it's a good option there, very good. Variety, and <laughs> this is the pronunciation, para variedad, variety, okay? That's okay. That's the, the, the pronunciation. Por ahí va, ahí les, les va a ir cayendo ya su, su boleta de presentación oral para que puedan ver sus, sus observations, ¿ok? That's it. Mostly, pero la mayoría anda con las mismas palabras de problemas de pronunciación. Variety, atmosphere, ¿ok? El otro sí. era el, el, el de ayer, el, el it depends, también es un error que la mayoría lo tiene. Ok, it depends, agréguenle la S y pónganle el it, ok, ahí el actually, nowadays, the difference, ok, etc. Remember, we are learning, so the more mistakes we make, better, ok, entre más errores haga mejor porque así va aprendiendo, right, pero si no habla, no va a saber qué errores tenemos, ok. So, very good, guys. That's it. Very good. Tengo aquí el reporte de Kike que está con problemas. Por eso no se ha podido conectar eh, de, de internet y ya me mandó los screenshots. Rapidito, vamos con la, 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 la última eh, eh, attendance, ¿ok? Carla Beatriz Aguilar Marroquín. Present. Verónica Beatriz Celso de Saldán. Present, teacher. Osmani Etzau de León. Present. Bania Itzel de las de Cañas. Presente. Blanca Estela Marroquín Ramírez. Blanca Estela Marroquín Ramírez. Ok, creo Me que... Me dijo que se le había ido la luz, teacher. Sí, eh, ajá, aquí tengo los mensajes. Sí, thank you, Itzel. Uh -huh. Sí, se le fue la okay. luz a él y, a, y a, aquí que tiene problemas también. Vamos, eh, Franklin de Jesús Martínez. Presente. Giovanni Alberto Orantes. Present. Dalila Estela Silva Morán. Present. 
Eh, María Araceli González Flores. Cinia Elizabeth Mejía de Sanabria. Cinia Elizabeth Mejía de Sanabria. Bueno, está aquí, pero no me contesta, pero así aquí la tenemos. Cine Elizabeth, ok, por favor, digan yes. presente. Ajá. Juan Carlos Molina Martín, eh, Sofía, perdón, Sofía Guadalupe Hernández. Present. Ok, eh, Juan Carlos Molina Martínez. Present. Claudia Ileana Cazún de Mengíbar. Present. Brenda Lucía Rosales Guzmán. Present, teacher. José Enrique Bermúdez, fue pues él estuvo un rato, pero se tuvo que, que desconectar. Y Gabriela Beatriz Reyes Ramírez. Present. Oscar Xavier Morales, is absent. And eh, Carla Joana Martínez de Martínez. Present. Okay, there you are, Carlita. Okay, my friends, this is giving suggestions. Okay, the class for today. Hoy se pueden ir a la plataforma. Y hacer el... Oh, Cynia Elizabeth. Ajá. Cynia Elizabeth. <laughs> Present. Sinia, hello. Present. <laughs> oh, present over there. Okay. <laughs> very nice. Guys, thank you very much for joining my class today. Okay. See you tomorrow. Have a beautiful morning and a delicious breakfast or delicious lunch or brunch. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye, guys. Thank you for joining. Bye. Bye. Bye.